<laughs> is it time for recess yet? I'm so glad you found time to join us here on the Child Care Director's Chair, where Erica Sacoccio shares her best practices that she's refined through her passion of directing child care centers over the last 23 years. From parenting interaction, systems to save you time, money, and stress, to profitability. She shares it all from the Child Care Director's Chair. Hey guys, Erica Sakosho here with another episode of the Child Care Director's Chair. And I have a question for you. Are you considering implementing uniforms for your teaching team, but you're not sure of the benefits? Well, this is a question that comes up a lot in our school. I'm a big advocate for wearing uniforms, and I thought I would talk about eight points of reasons why I think that it will give your program an incredible advantage when you have your teachers wear uniforms. The first thing is right off the top of my head, it enhances professionalism. Uniforms instantly create a sense of professionalism among your teaching staff. When they are wearing a uniform, they exude a unified and cohesive image that reflects their commitment to their profession. This professional appearance extends a positive impression for students, for parents, and the wider community. I also believe wearing school uniforms foster a school spirit. Uniforms promote a sense of belonging and unity within your teaching team. And when everyone is dressed in the same attire, it creates a strong bond among staff members, fostering positive and supportive work environments. And this camaraderie will undoubtedly trickle down to the students and enhance school spirit and pride. I mean, think about, you know, even outside of work, like who's your favorite football team or baseball team, right? We love wearing those types of uniforms to signify, this is what I like. This is what I believe in. So it should be the same for your school. I also believe that it helps improve safety and security. Uniforms can play a vital role in ensuring the safety and security of your educational institution. By easily identifying staff members through their uniforms, it becomes easier to distinguish them from outsiders. And this added layer of security helps maintain a safe learning environment for both students and staff. And not to mention when your licensing worker comes or you're doing a tour for families and there are multiple adults in the room, it's very easy to see who works there and who doesn't. Or think about that new student who's only been there a day or two. It's very easy for them to figure out what adults they should be talking to and who should um, you know, they be going to for things. So I think it just does help with safety. And it certainly can save time. Eliminating address code issues, implementing uniforms, eliminates that need for detailed dress code policies. And this saves valuable time and effort that would otherwise be spent on enforcing and monitoring appropriate attire. And when you say professional wear, not everybody values that or looks at that in the same way. So with uniforms, everyone's on the same page, ensuring consistency and avoiding potential distractions caused by inappropriate clothing choices. And you all know what I'm talking about. We've seen them all, the yoga pants, the bras, the undergarments, uh, the half shirts, uh, if you've been in the field a long time, you know what I'm talking about. The jeans that are too tight, all of it. So this would help, you know, eliminate that and help your school have a more polished image. It can also promote equality. Uniforms create a level playing field for all staff members, regardless of their socioeconomic background, by removing the pressure to keep up with fashion trends or purchase expensive clothing, uniforms promote equality and inclusivity. And this allows your teaching team to focus solely on their core mission of educating and nurturing your students. I also think streamlining morning routines. Morning routines can be chaotic for both students and teachers. However, by adapting uniforms, you can simplify the morning routine for your teaching team. No more worrying about what to wear or spending valuable time choosing outfits. Uniforms provide a hassle-free solution allowing teachers to focus on preparing for the day. And not to mention, I mean, how many of us work with bleach and water, soap and water, uh, paint, uh, you know, bingo markers that get all over your nice clothing? 
So why ruin your nice clothing? Have a uniform that is easy, easy to wash, uh, easy to wear, wrinkle-free. Um, you know, it really just makes your life easier for you and your teachers. And not to mention the marketing perspective. It can enhance your branding and school identity. Uniforms serve as a powerful branding tool for your educational institution. Create a constant and recognizable image that represents your school's values and identity. And this branding extends beyond the classroom, leaving a lasting impression on students, parents, and the community at large. And think about when and where do you, you know, wear those uniforms. Uh, perhaps when um, you're out at events doing tables or visiting schools, dropping off thank you notes and um, going out to the local senior centers to drop off cards or different things that you're doing uh, with your community projects. And lastly, it instills discipline and focus. Wearing uniforms instill a sense of discipline and focus among your teaching team. The act of putting on a uniform signals a transi transition from your personal life to your professional responsibilities. Helping teachers mentally prepare for their role as educators. And this increased focus translates into a more productive and engaging learning environment for your students. So there you have it. In conclusion, the benefits of having your teaching team wear uniforms are numerous and impactful. From enhancing professionalism and fostering school spirit to improving the safety and streamline routines, uniforms offer a multitude of advantages for your school. So my vote is yay. Implement uniforms for your program. Make sure that they fit with your school vibe. Make sure that they, you know, are, are the branding that you would like for your center and it matches through all of your marketing so you have consistency and cohesiveness. So that's it for today on the Child Care Director's Chair. We thank you so much for tuning in. If you have not already, please give us a like, a follow, a subscribe, a review, whatever you feel in your heart to do. We appreciate it and it helps our small channel grow. So thank you again and have a great day. Well, all the cute little kiddos have been picked up and it's time to go home. And that'll do it for another episode of the Child Care Director's Chair. Please leave a review so Erica knows the information is helping you to manage and improve your child care centers. Remember to subscribe to get the latest episode from Erica's Child Care Director's Chair. <laughs>